slept with my father. It's our baby. That's all that matters. Can we please just move on? You slept with my father. I don't... I don't remember. It was like an out-of-body experience. Oh. Oh, my God. He vowed revenge. He said he would decimate me. And now he slept with you and you don't even remember. Oh, my God. Steffi, are you okay? Are you okay? Did, did he do this to you? Did he take advantage of you? You're giving it to him? That's what a gift is, Wyatt. Uh, By definition, it's something you give someone. Like a rare bottle of scotch, or, or a nice tie, perhaps, but a, a beach house in Malibu? Don't worry, you'll get a gift of equal value when the time comes. Oh my, I, I, don't, I guess I'm just surprised by the whole thing, that's all. I mean, after everything that Liam did to you, taking over the company, kicking you out, do you... Yeah, I'm, I, I'm, I don't need to be reminded, Wyatt, but thanks. Okay. You've been good enough, haven't you? Considering Liam and his little stunt that he pulled. To top it off, you're going to give him and Steffi the house. Well, what can I tell you? I'm, I'm a generous guy. I love Liam. I love all you boys. And I want the best for you. I hope you know that. I think we've learned to read between the lines. I want Liam and Steffi to have the Cliff House. I think it'll be a great place for them to raise a family. You know, don't you? I know what? I mean, nothing. I mean, just, yeah. Could I say anything? Okay. I mean, does Liam know that you're giving him Cliff House? I haven't told him yet. So you haven't actually talked to him lately? Wyatt, if you have to tell me something, will you spit it out? Okay, it, oh, it's a secret. So, like, if you know about it, we can talk about it freely. But if you don't, I'm not, I'm not at liberty to say. In the interest of not having to jump out my window from listening to you any further. Yes, Wyatt, I know. Steffi's pregnant. I am well aware. It's awesome, isn't it? It's great. They're starting a new chapter. Best time of their lives. Everything is as it should be. You said my dad just showed up, right? Steffi, did he take advantage of you? Huh? Did he do this to hurt me? This son of a bitch drug you? Oh my God, my poor baby. My poor baby. I'm so sorry. Listen, listen. Don't protect him. Because if he drugged you or, or, or anything, he has to be held accountable, okay? Did he do this to get to me? Did he use you to get to me? Stop, tell me that's what happened, Steffi. Please tell me that's what happened. It's been sinking in, like, I'm gonna be an uncle. And I'm not even sure how to do that. Ah, uh, come on, why? Just be yourself. You know, the, the goofy, fun guy. What? Look, you, you know, when you're the uncle or the granddad, you just you load the kids full of sugar and you hand them back to the parents. <laughs> it sounds like a great idea. There you go. You know, Liam and Steffi have been trying for so long to have a family, and, and now it's happening. It's an exciting time. I'm, I'm sorry I didn't share it with you. Liam kind of wanted to keep it quiet and, you know. No, I, I... I respect that way. I mean, I understand why they want to stay under the radar. After losing the first child and fertility issues, it's just been tough on them. Yeah. yeah. But the good news is that's, that's all, uh, it's all behind them now. Steffi's having Liam's baby. 
I mean, what's more wonderful than welcoming another Spencer into the fold, huh? And you, how do you feel, granddad? I know you care about my relationship with my father, but you can't protect him. Not now, okay? Did he target you to get back at me? God, I wanted to tell you the truth. I just regret everything. I just wish I stayed here that night. It's okay, just, just tell me what happened. Tell me, tell me everything. Bill came by. It's okay. He came by the guest house. He knew I was upset. He knew that I was in pain, but I swear I didn't. I didn't know that he was gonna show up. And then we just started. We started talking about you and Sally and how you kissed her and that I was shattered and I, I thought that we were over. I just wasn't thinking clearly. Okay. You weren't thinking clearly before or after he showed up. What? It mat well, it, it matters. Did he, Steffi, did he offer you something? Did he, did he pour you a drink? Are you sure? Because this is, this is critical. No. No, no, Bill didn't, he didn't drug me. He didn't, he didn't give me a drink. I don't know, Liam. I don't know. I, it's hard to explain. I just, I can't remember. And I know it sounds like a cop out, but it's the truth. It just felt like I was in this, like, my God, this, this altered state. But Bill never, he never drugged me. He didn't force himself on me. It was awful and terrible, but I can't blame Bill. I can only blame myself. I betrayed you in the worst way. And I'm so, so sorry, Liam. I'm so sorry. Obviously in order. Straightforward transaction. You're needing the property to Liam free and clear. Wish all of my assignments were this easy. Uh, no, you hold on to it. Grab Liam's signature when he comes in, then I'll start the paperwork. We'll be all set. Thanks, Justin. Yeah. It's a nice gift. Isn't it? Yeah. And hopefully I'll be the next big <laughs> winner, right? As soon as you do something to warrant it. I'll work on that. Mm -hmm. Hey. You know how nothing gets by you, Dad? <laughs> you remind us every day. I know what's going on with you. What are you talking about? Your secret. Secret? I like that. It's good. A look of casual confusion. <laughs> You've been quiet about her. Ducking out, sneaking around. But I know she exists. Just haven't put a name to her yet. But I will. <laughs> I, I wouldn't waste resources. It's casual. Mm-hmm. Where are you off to? Back to work, Columbo. I mean, you, you are thinking way more about this than I am. <laughs> it is really awesome of you to give Liam the beach house, especially since he and Steffi are starting their family. Uh, can't help but wonder. Coy's not a good look on you, Justin. Just spit it out. Oh, this unprecedented generosity. Is that your way of making up for what you did with Steffi? Alleviating some of your guilt? My father? My father. For weeks now, you've been, oh. You've been brokering peace. You've been visiting him. You've been defending him. You've been taking his side over your own husband's. Tell me something. Did your little visits involve more than conversation? No. Did he come on to you? No. So what? So he shows up 
and you guys. God, was this even the first time? Yes. Yes, we were just, we were in the moment, just like you and Sally were. Excuse me? What did you say? What did you just say? I'm saying that what my love for you say? has not wavered, just like you didn't when you kissed her. You are comparing a desperate kiss to you having sex with my father. No, I know, I know it's not the same, I know that. Good, because that's ridiculous. It's ridiculous. I thought I knew who you were. <laughs> Can you imagine anything, anything at all that would hurt me more than this? <laughs> or is that the point? To get back at me? You want to get back at me for Sally? No. Yeah? No. No, no, no I know this is killing you. I don't want you to be in this pain. Maybe we just, we just take a moment. We just take a moment, some time, to just breathe. Oh, some time? For a second, please, time? Please, please, what please, for, please, Steffi? Liam, what, I'm to reassess sorry, my you've feelings? Gotta believe me. I'm I'll sorry, tell you I've got to believe me. I'm sorry, I've got to What do you see? What do you see when you look at me? I see the man that I love. No, look at me. Really look at me. What do you see? Do you see a sap? Hmm? Do you see a sucker? No. You see somebody you can no. betray in the most evil way possible? Are you like him? Do you think that my values make me, make me weak? And spineless? No, no. No? Never. Then why did you have sex with my father? <laughs> why? All this time. This is this was your dirty little secret. You're just oh, you're just walking around wondering if the baby you're carrying is his. And not a word to me, Steffi. I can forgive a lot. I can forgive so much. But you have changed us. This isn't just us, Liam. We have a family. I have a don't, baby don't. inside of me. I have our baby inside of me. We have everything we've ever wanted. We have it all. We had. We had it all. Until you threw it away, which, frankly, I'm still trying to understand. And uh, I'm coming up a little short. Because I loved you so much. You were my world. <laughs> I was just outside. I was thinking about how lucky I am to have you and our family and our child and our future. And somewhere, my father is laughing at me. Liam the fool. No, no, Liam, you're not a fool. You're not a fool. I love no. you, and I'm so, I'm so lucky to share a life with you. I am so lucky. This isn't the end, okay? I'm having your child, and I will do anything I can to make it up to you. Just please, please forgive me. I promise to be faithful. I promise to be the wife that you could trust. Just please tell me. Tell me that we still have a life together. Tell me that we have a future. Tell me that we're still a family. Please, Liam, I'm begging you. Please tell me that, please. I always intended to give Liam the Cliff House once he and Steffi were starting a family. So this... Gift is just a coincidence. Maybe you're right, Justin. I mean, maybe guilt plays a role. I'm definitely guilty, right? I slept with my son's wife. I, I never intended to betray Lee in this way. I, honest to God, I thought they were done. But that doesn't justify it either. It just, it just happened in the moment. Because you have feelings for her. That doesn't matter, right? Steffi is my son's wife. I've only wanted the best for my boys, and now Liam has that. He, Steffi, the baby on the way, they are going to make a, a wonderful family. 
and I'm going to do everything I can to love and support them. You're a good man, Dollar Bill. You're a good dad. Look, Liam is lucky to have you. Please tell me you forgive me. Don't. How do I forgive you for destroying our lives? We can put us back together. And what about the rest? You think I'd... You think I'd sail into work now? Back at the office like everything's great? Don't you understand? I'm afraid I might kill him. I hate him. And I hate you. If you want me to leave, I, I can, and then when you're ready, I'll, I'll come back. You're not the one leaving. I can't be here. In my, in my father's house, where we renewed our vows right after you slept with him. This is, this is a lie. All of this, it's a lie. No, Liam. And I can't Liam, you're not going. Liam, do not leave me. Please don't leave me. No, no. Don't you get it? It's over now. No. It's all over. No, no. Please don't. Liam, please don't do this. No. Liam, no. Come back here. Liam, please don't leave me. Liam, please don't leave me. Liam, please I loved don't you leave me. more than anything <laughs> or anyone in my whole life. I wanted a family with you. I wanted to be a father. I wanted to be a parent with you. Because giving my child what I never had growing up was the most important thing I could do. And providing stability and love to that child was the most important thing I could do. That is the culmination of my whole existence. Shut, shut up, shut up. There is nothing more important than giving stability and love to our child. And you, you took that away from me. You took that away. You took that away from our child. How could you do that? How could you do that?